for an extrovert hey day might come as a joy to you but what about introverts maybe you can actually use this day to make friends want to know what i'm talking about stick till the end of the video to find out what is hey day hello everyone and welcome back to another university review in this series we take you through a university where we talk about its rankings the popular courses the average tuition fees scholarship options and so much more today we have with us the auburn university from alabama Without any further ado, let's jump straight into today's video. Auburn University is a public land grant research university in Auburn, Alabama. Established over 160 years ago in 1856, it is one of Alabama's two public flagship universities and is the second largest university in the state. The university is classified among R1 doctoral universities very high research activity by Carnegie and its alumni include five Rhodes scholars and five Truman scholars The university throughout its history has been known by very names before becoming the Auburn University to acknowledge the varied academic programs and larger curriculum of a major university It is ranked at number 99 among the national universities and among the top 50 in the best public universities in the nation by the US News in 2022. The acceptance rate of the university is 71%. In terms of the location, the university is located in Auburn, Alabama at the foothills of the Appalachian Mountains in the southern region of the US. It spans a humongous area of around 1875 acres. You can visit the Chuaklla State Park located just 4 miles away and enjoy numerous trails for hikes and explore the hidden waterfalls. The university is home to more than 30,000 students. The ratio of male to female students is quite equal with 51% male students and 49% female students. The average class strength at Auburn is 20 to 49 students with around 48% of their classes having between 20 to 49 students and around 36% classes having fewer than 20 students and only 15% of their classes having over 50 students. The university also boasts a retention rate or student satisfaction rate of a whopping 92%. Auburn University offers more than 150 undergraduate degrees including top ranked programs in engineering, business, supply chain management, journalism, architecture and design and fisheries or aquaculture. For graduate degree programs it offers 25 degrees through the four colleges under it. The university offers courses in numerous disciplines like agricultural and animal sciences, biochemistry and applied biotechnology, mathematics and engineering fisheries and aquatic sciences arts and humanities journalism and marketing business and management the most popular majors at auburn university include business management and marketing engineering biological and biomedical sciences health professions and related programs communication journalism and related programs education agricultural animal plant or veterinary science computer and information sciences family and consumer sciences or human sciences and social sciences the acceptance rate at auburn is 71% meaning for every 100 applicants 71 students are admitted this means that the school is moderately selective Their academic requirements differ from degree to degree. For graduate programs, you need to have a bachelor's degree or its equivalent from an accredited college or university. The university also requires you to produce your GRE or GMAT scores. However, the university had waived off these requirements for certain programs for their fall 2022 intake. For bachelors you'll need to have a competitive GPA along with above average standardized test scores. The average score required to get into Auburn is between 1100 and 1300 in SAT which is a competitive score. As an international student if your first language is not English you will be required to submit an IELTS or TOEFL score. For IELTS the minimum requirement is 6.5 band 
and for TOEFL the minimum score is 79 for IBT, 213 for CBT and 550 for PBT. If you're enjoying watching this video consider giving us a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel. The tuition cost for programs varies depending on the choice of your course. The average tuition fees will cost you around $32,246 per academic year. You'll have to bear the additional cost of housing and dining as well, which can differ based on what type of accommodation you choose. As a student, there are some additional miscellaneous costs you'll have to incur as well. The total cost can be broken down somewhat like this. Auburn University provides a variety of scholarships to eligible students through the Auburn University Scholarship Opportunity Manager or AWESOME. AWESOME has many useful online features and benefits. Students can easily search, review requirements, apply and accept awards for available scholarship opportunities and more. Interested students apply for all institutional scholarships using this online application. Students are only required to complete the AWESOME application once each academic year. You can find scholarships like the Academic Presidential Scholarships, Spirit of Auburn Scholarships, 100 Women Scholarships, Al and Dudley Scholarships, and many more such scholarships. The university also considers its students for need-based scholarships. The average need-based scholarship or grant awarded to first-year students at Auburn University was $9,801. Merit-based aid is awarded for a specific talent or academic achievement. The average merit-based scholarship or grant awarded to first-year students at Auburn University, excluding any athletic scholarships, was $7,645. Auburn University has 24 residence halls which are home to over 4,500 students. All residential neighborhoods are a short walk to classroom buildings, dining venues, downtown Auburn and the student center. All residence hall rooms and suites are furnished and feature air conditioning, high-speed wireless internet service, cable television and window blinds. Residential common areas include kitchens, laundry rooms, meeting rooms, study lounges and social lounges. These residence halls include the Cambridge Hall, the South Donahue Hall, the Hill Residence Halls, the Village Residence Halls, the Quad Residence Halls, the 191 College and the 160 Ross. You get several choices of rooms to choose from. You can opt for single room, double room, triple room or even quad room. Although triple room and quad room choices are fairly limited. The details for the pricing of accommodation in these facilities are given right here. These prices are per student per semester and include all utilities. If you do not wish to live in the accommodations provided by the university, the off-campus housing locator will help you in finding accommodation outside the campus. Part-time jobs are a great way to earn some money and reduce the total cost of your education. Human Resources supports more than 3,200 student workers at Auburn University. And Auburn University makes it fairly easier for students to find employment on campus. All you need to do is visit auemployment.com, go to search jobs and if you scroll down you'll see all these open job postings. Or if you want, you can select specific filters from these scroll menus right here and select wherever you want to work and you'll be shown the job postings available as per your preferences. International students are eligible to hold on-campus student employment positions per the terms of their visa. To be eligible to work on campus as a student employee, you must meet one of the following criteria. Enrolled and taking classes during the semester you are employed or not enrolled in classes for the semester of employment but was enrolled in the previous semester and will be enrolled and have a class schedule for the following semester including the summer semester. The Office of International Student and Scholar Services welcomes students and scholars from around the world. 
Each year, more than 2,500 international students, visiting scholars, and employees from over 100 nations participate in the Auburn experience. International students receive the needed immigration support documentation required for entry into the U.S. and the assistance needed to maintain the appropriate status. Students also receive information about CPT, OPT, and other employment opportunities. Now you're probably wondering what that intro was about. So Auburn University has a tradition of celebrating Hay Day. Dating all the way back to World War II, Auburn University's student body and members of the Student Government Association pushed for a day that would unite the Auburn family and promote a friendly atmosphere known as Hay Day. It started because when the soldiers returned from the war, the students at Auburn wanted to find a way to greet them properly. Each year, name tags are handed out encouraging students, faculty and the rest of the Auburn family to greet one another in an effort to bring all those part of Auburn closer together. And with that, we come to the end of this video. Share this video with a friend who wants to study in the US and might want some help in shortlisting universities. Let us know in the comment section below if you missed something that you would like us to cover in the next video. And if you enjoyed watching this video, do give us a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more such content. Hit the notification bell so you'll be notified when our next video is out and I'll see you guys in the next video.